So oh, yeah, if not. You guys probably probably remember it with a good <coughs> intelligence. Intelligence. All right. Do, 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 do. I got it. Yep. Well, I'm, I'm gonna roll it anyway. One. What do I roll? No. Yeah. Can't uh, Early, you're rolling a plus five. Oh wow! Okay. Shit! Congrats. Um, I'll be a twenty-four. I love it how Raggy's not even trying to participate in this one. Oh, <laughs> oh. Uh, yeah, I didn't oh really... shit! So, so, funnily enough, I choose my character quite well, but you gave me that thing where if I fuck rolls up, I'm screwed for the rest of the day. So. Uh... <laughs> I yeah. Which one? Uh, I can't remember. But if I fail a skill roll, I'm at minus two for the rest of the day. Well, this is not a skill roll. Oh, uh, still, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Bad luck and all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, true. Uh, hang on. What? Eight. What? Plus five. Well, Mackenzie's clever. Yeah, it's just our dice suck. Oh, oh all right, damn it. The yeah, roll got progressively worse. She has a uh, 20 intelligence. Mm. There you go. Apparently I'm cleverer than everyone in the party. Uh, well, look at Owen. Owen. Yeah, okay, fine. <laughs> Owen? Yes? You don't know, but maybe a bit of your brain was, uh, was replaced as well with a robotic brain because you are calculating at super speeds. And you're, real, and you're realizing something. Mm -hmm. There was no point of blast. The entire building went up. At the that, same time. That's not natural at all. Um, no, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, so yeah, yeah. Like, just, just a hunch. Just a hunch, good sir. Just a hunch. Um, no, I was, was kind of like, what? Uh, explosion of a building is supposed to be natural? Oh, no, 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 no. I mean, no, normally, you know, unless the whole fucking thing was laced with explosives, we'd all go up at Let's once. Um, hmm, well, fuck me, uh, that's not really a help. I guess it's kind of a help. I don't really know. Or, hmm. Um, suicide? Give me a moment. Um... I mean, knowing this town, there this was could not be a... much left of what was inside the building, was there? From the outside, no. <laughs> it looked like it had been torched horribly. Which, uh, since Vadim is of arcane descent, and he's thinking of this right now, mm -hmm. he he would have to surmise that it would have to have been a really big blast and a rather hot fire in order to destroy magical items. Or very hot. <laughs> Knowledge Arcana is would there be any kind of precedent for something that could set off the spells in an entire building's worth of magical items at the same time. <laughs> Ooh, Vadim, you are on point. Give yourself 50. There actually is a way to set off spells hidden within magical items. And you're looking around and you notice quite a few necklaces on the wall having little rubies in them. Mm -hmm. You can make a hmm. craft check on these. Yes, uh, that is what is going to happen. And that is... seven. Oh, nope. Oh, you're looking at you're looking at these, and you're realizing they are <laughs> multiple ones of 
of Necklaces of Fireballs Type 5. Mm. Tell me where these where you got where these necklaces ended up coming in from. Did they all come in together? Oh no, they've thought they've always been here. Hmm. No kitty. Hmm. No, they've always been here. I I carry them myself, I make them myself, I have my own little crafting station on the third floor. I store all the extras on the second floor. I have usually about 10 to 15 at all times. Is there a they well, word they for go them? like hotcakes. Mm-hmm. I'm sure they do. Yeah. People actually use like use the rubies in them in order to put it in their fireplace and it keeps it it keeps it going for the entire winter. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um Pardon me a moment. Sure, sure. Uh, by the way, you, my horny friend. Ha! 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 Uh, that's all of us, I suppose. Um, yes, go on. Yes, how can I... Uh, uh, yes, Mysterio, what's up? I just wanted to give you this. As he hands you a... Damn it, I had it right here. Here it is, here it is, here it is. No, 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 no. It was right here. Where is it? I could have swore it was right here. Right here. Fucking hell. He hand he hands you an amulet. Okay. It look it looks to be that of the head of the wolf. Okay. He says this is an amulet of natural armor plus two. Oh, cool! That's very kind of you. Is there See, any particular way you'd like to be buried? Uh, well, there's always there was this, there's this hill over on the uh, northern side of town that g- does the. That gives the best outlook of the ocean with uh, with a good view of the sunset. I would like uh, to be buried there if you can. Are there any family you'd like informed? Uh, only child. Parents died when I was young. Oh. And would you like to be resurrected at some point? Nah, <laughs> nah. I've been alive for quite a while. I think it's time for me to die. Okay. Um... <laughs> That's an, uh, 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 an uh, okay. uh, 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 I want to ask, uh, you don't have any competition around here, do you? Anybody who kind of hates your guts? No, no, Mysterio got along with everyone just fine. From what Mysterio could tell. Mm. Fair enough. So, I feel like we Mysterio we've... is bad at reading people. Mm, probably. I can tell that if I use the word Mysterio one more time, someone's going to put an arrow in my head. May not necessarily uh, be an arrow. I'd be more worried about the fact that... Um, did you give all these necklaces different command words? Yeah. Uh, you don't... You don't use a command word with a... You pull, the, you, you pull the gem out and throw it. Oh, do you? Or oh. a... Or, a, like, basically the uh, gem is a rather solidified and compressed fireball. Uh, depending on the type is how many gems are, are available. I have the maximum ones. But a good... Uh, you know, if you think about it, a dispel will actually unravel all the magic and get the fireballs going at the same time. Uh, yeah, kind of... 
putting that together. Possibly be the design flaw there. Well, you can't... Not so much a design flaw as the fact that he has like 30 of these in his goddamn store. Well, for now. To be fair, they'll be gone later. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, he was only able to make Type 5s. We have, um... Let's see here. The Type 5s... Have one fireball gem that do 96, two that do 76, two that do 5d6, and two to do 3d6. Mm-hmm. So that's one, two, three, six, 16, 30, 48 d6 worth of fire for each one. Yeah, and there is about 20 of them. About. Yeah, that's, that's quite a bit. That's a lot of fireball. Yeah. 960 D6. I think yeah. that would do it. <laughs> I think that level of fucking hell, yeah. Um, uh, hmm. Um, I want to look around. Do you, do you guys know of anybody who could do this? Um, kind of not familiar with this place all that much. Well, it's not like that. Apparently, if you huh? tied if you tied a hundred pigeons together and gave them a lump, uh, and gave them a lump of coal, that would be equivalent to a uh, naval. Uh, we'll, we'll we'll put his we'll just we'll just shush Raggy just now. That would be equivalent to uh, a naval. What are they called? Railgun. That could probably do it. <laughs> anyway, what would you say, Zara? Got in here because. because Douglas decided to be Douglas. What? <laughs> uh, basically, anyone who could do magic can cast a dispel. Yeah. You'd have to be pretty high end though, because to make a to make a time to type five, well, you only need to pay more gold. But basically, you need to be able to cast fireball and craft wondrous items. Yeah. Um. Mm. Which each one is uh, caster level ten. Yeah. Uh, Vadim, Vadim walks back inside. Vadim, Vadim looks a little bit wet. Eh, it happens. Mm. Figure anything out. Uh, uh, Ipen's arcane too. She could. She probably, She might know things. She's very intelligent. What she wants to be. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Any ideas? Of? Anything that's happened in the past 20 minutes. Shop exploding, necklaces. Any ideas? You did say that it had to be hot enough to melt magical items, yes? Well, 906, was it? Uh, I think it was like 967. Yeah, that's uh, that's hot enough. So it's either, and you did mention about the fireball necklaces and oh, there goes my turn here. Uh. Yeah, thought. Oh, there's that. There goes that. So it had to be. Did did anybody happen to look off? Like they weren't a local or didn't seem like a local? Yeah, just some crazy motherfuckers that were running away. Hmm. No idea what they were running from. Hmm. Your shop exploding. You know it could have been them. I highly doubt that. Um, so, so it could have been did Matt something set off the magical items inside, right? Didn't mm-hmm. mention that? Uh, basically, basically the theory of it is right now, if you're paying attention. 
is that someone casted a spell in order to dispel the magics holding the fireballs in place, which caused about shit tons of fire damage. I did hear that. I just want to recap. Thank you. You didn't accidentally let off a dispel spell, did you? No, I'm not that stupid. <laughs> just checking. Do you have an assistant? Or did you have an assistant? He's about ready to put a cigar up to his mouth and take a puff when he goes, Ah. I have one of those. Oh, God, I have two oh. of those. Oh? Uh, oh. They, you tell. Called, they called in sick today. Mm hmm. Mm. A, a, a light bulb appears above Rocky's head. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, since it's raggy, I don't expect a light bulb. I expect a candle. <laughs> okay. and there's a breeze blowing. <laughs> <laughs> can't, a, a candle that is immediately snuffed out. <laughs> As he looks around confused and scratches his chin. Or as soon as the light bulb does go off, go on over Raggy's head, Vadim reaches up and pulls the chain to turn it off again. <laughs> Uh, this actually, is actually, no, no, no. <laughs> you know what happens when you have ideas? People lose limbs. No, 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 no. I, want, I, I actually am interested about this because he was like, ding, light bulb. And I'm like, okay. Douglas, let's hear your idea. <laughs> no, it, was, it wasn't that. I didn't actually really have anything clever to say. <laughs> 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 Well, that's okay because the light bulbs go off now, and I'm and I'm staring blankly at the uh, at the space in front of me. Well, <laughs> so so who? If were... you don't mind me asking, what were they like? Over their Back names, at least. Yeah. Uh, one was named Julrod, and the other one was named Kenny. Well, oh, Julrod Kenny. and Kenny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't right. catch that one. Okay, did I, ac did I accidentally make a reference? No, not that I no. know of. No, it's just those names. It's just like, yeah, you got this one. Ah, oh, Kenny. Fuck Kenny. We don't like Kenny. He dies all the time. <laughs> um, oh my god. No, no. I can tell you this right now. For fuck's sake, yeah. Kenny was trying to make a type 1 fightable necklace, and he nearly blew up my shop. Okay. Mm. And what about the other one? Oh, she was a star pupil. She so, did it uh, correctly. Frankenstein and Frankenstein's monster. Just like, give me one second. And he he presses a button right next right next to him. You don't see a button, but he looks like he presses a button, and he starts he starts going down as if he's on an elevator shaft, right behind the counter. Oh, all right. Owen peeks over the counter. He's just, he's just bending his knees. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, so and... then. And. Mm. Owen takes three points of damage as he, as something smacks him upside the head. Fair enough. <laughs> and twitches. Um, hmm. Uh, Vadim? Mm -hmm. There is no motive. He's uh, getting something from behind his counter. Oh, okay. well, I meant the, um, in, in, in general on things, the feeling that I'm getting from him. Eh, he's dead. He has no well. reason to lie. <laughs> So, star people, have you had a fight with like... him recently? No, no, no. It's you like... hear him shuffling and throwing things from behind the counter. You see a dog go up in the air and then go back from behind, go back down behind the counter. Well, fair enough. Oh, um, damn it. It's like, woo! Woo! Yeah. Um, anyway. And he finally comes up and puts something on the table. Oh, my, my star pupil just made this. I mean, I, I was going to sell it to the local weapon shop, but this was kind of, uh, yeah. Uh, I'm give me one sec. 
Mm-hmm. Let's see here. One, two, three, four, five. They both called in sick. Yes, they did. Okay. Mm-hmm. But he uh, he basically comes out with a little cloth, mm-hmm. and he yeah. opens it up, and inside is a beautifully. Well, here, let me just give you a picture, okay? Okay. But we know where that leads, Eric. I can't. Ooh. Might be IRL, bitch. What's, <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's going on? <laughs> oh, well, we're getting. Uh, you guys are waiting patiently while I get, while I go into my images folder. And get that image of a of the weapon that I have chosen. Gotcha. My star pupil was, of course, rather. Uh, he kind of, kind of like clicks his tongue, switches it, like switches his hand side to side. She was very angry, type person. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. And the man's problem character. So she did what she did was decided to make this. Gotcha. Oh wait, no, this is better. This is much better. <laughs> um, okay. Do do do. Unfolds uh, it and reveals a cane. Owen, uh, Owen will pick it up and inspect it. And, uh, I'll say, I'll say hi and wave to the skull. <laughs> I think it's fake. Mm. Mm. It is made. It is made up. Is made out of a uh, grouping together of ruby and onyx. A rather beautiful combination, I should say. Hand carved mm. it herself. She made the made the blade out of iodized silver, carved it using black oak. Hmm. Sounds oh, pretty nice. Well, it's a look at fine, fine weapon. I shall say. Hmm. It looks like uh, it too. Uh, is, it oh. isn't enchanted, is it? Or magical? I don't, honestly, I don't. I don't. I, just, uh, I don't. I would I would I would use I would sense magic, detect magic, but as as I know, bad shit would happen. Um, I, oh, I assume it's magical. See that word? I do, I do, but not right now. Not right now. Um, do me a favor and describe this assistant to me. Ah, mm-hmm. uh, let's see here. She is of the catfolk pers- uh, catfolk variety. She mm-hmm. has midnight black fur, with a silver linings around her ears, and a short tail. Okay. She likes mm-hmm. to wear light armor. Okay. Out of character? Well, that kills that theory. <laughs> <laughs> Out of character? What theory? You don't see cat. You don't see cat from Gotham, um, do you? I was thinking it was connected to. I'm sure you do. Uh, right, that it could have been. Um, What's your face? Yeah, under a suit on him. Ah. Duvalia. Yeah, that's it. Um. Oh yeah, no. I'm not giving. What? I'm not giving you guys clues that easy. This isn't even connected to any of that shit. Gotcha. Hey, I gotta take a chance. Why are we here? I don't know. And this explosion. Because plus one things have intrigued me. Yes. Like um, that plus one cane sword. Mm-hmm. Uh, the situation in general. Yeah. Uh, um, and I know you haven't confirmed it's plus one or not. I'm just saying that. Uh, oh, oh, no. I, 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 was, I was just going to be like, wow, are you a wizard? <laughs> <laughs> are you a wizard? No, no, no. Actually, um, 
I, I take it Owen uses cane swords too. Yeah, I have a cane sword in my my special scythe. I kinda, my throwing scythe. I kind of like I the I rolled the d5 because I was gonna decide who got the weapon. <laughs> and guess who's number three? Mm. Owen. Nope. Ruby. Yeah, I, I assume Vadim. Yeah, this is like. I actually have uh, certain weapons all drawn up. This one reacts to a Magus Arcana. Oh. <laughs> it doubles. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's just like a fucking bastard. <laughs> just give me that log like. <laughs> just. Uh, 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 Mysterio takes, <laughs> takes it out of your hands and he unsheaths it. You notice, the sil you notice the silver and, she and he's like. Normally, it would be much harder to do damage with a, with silver weapons, but this one, she made it rather oddly. It has, uh, uh, he points towards the center of the blade, it has this, uh, this center rod made out of adamantium, which actually mitigates the damage, the damage penalty of a silver weapon, but at the same time, gives it more heft. Fair enough. And the skull, I see. the skull absorbs arcane. Points. <laughs> Basically, let's just say this: if you were to say stab a magus, Hi. you would steal one of their arcane pool. I see. You can try it out. Stab yourself. You can even store one of your own in there by just concentrating on it, and you can have it the next day for free. Hmm. I think she All said right. you could store a maximum of three points in here. And, uh, basically, if you were to spend a point in order to improve it, in, it would, uh, double up. That is a very intriguing weapon. It does have one minor flaw, though. Don't they always? Well, everything has to have a flaw, otherwise it's not fun. The skulls pinch, the skull's teeth pinch your palm. I no. don't know what you mean. I'm not flawed at all. And I put my hand on my hip. <laughs> I think the I think everyone on the planet just strangely enough turned to look in Maggie's direction. <laughs> yeah, pretty yeah. much. <laughs> other people on other continents, no idea what they're doing. Just something just happened. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the it gods was and wrong. the demons. The gods, the demons, the undead, every single person in the entire known Galarian universe looks right towards Raggy. <laughs> feel you feel thousands of eyes staring at you. Raggy feels a lot of eyes staring at him. He's getting the attention he wants, it doesn't matter. I was about ready to say, uh, uh, like the first thought that came into my head, Douglas is going to say, Raggy starts stripping. Yeah, no, this day he's not... No, he's, uh, he's not. He's not a uh, verge. He just realizes, just for a moment, his paranoia is justified. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 fuck! Oh, uh. anyway, the flaw of the cane is this: it's. Not exactly the most friendly thing. What do you mean? There's a five percent chance you attack one of your one of your allies. Cute. Ooh. So it has like a mind of its own choice. Sure, that acceptable losses. <laughs> <laughs> Vadim turns his head. What? Are you going to kill the oh, with your cane? Oh, no, no, completely acceptable. But, um, he, uh, reaches down. Mm-hmm. Karn the Betrayer. Ha! <laughs> Cute. He reaches behind the counter, pulls out, uh, pulls out a booklet, skims through it, rips out a paper, hands it, hands it over to whoever's closest. Uh, I guess that'd be Owen. Here are their addresses. Uh, be careful of Kenny. He's a rather odd goblin. Oh. Alright. Fair enough. 
Anything else we should know about uh, the the star one besides she's very angry? Um, she's also very promiscuous. So, good are the thy loins. <laughs> Fair. Like, no, let me face the peril. <laughs> uh, gotcha. Uh, All right then. Uh, we'll try and track down your killers then. Um, pretty sure it's the star people. Um, not gonna jump to conclusions. So, uh, <laughs> nah, I think that's the right. other way around. I think she already told us that she was straight. Uh. As straight as I can. Gonna... So, who's taking the cane sword? I'm not a mage, Magus. Yoink. <laughs> You've hated the Vadim. I'm kind of like a magic? Wow. For some yeah, reason. a magic. A magic. Mm. If you can't even oh. pronounce the class correctly, you are not allowed to have it. <laughs> Said magic, <laughs> goddammit. I don't know how I heard magic. Anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna go with uh, Bloody on this one, dude. I I'm. What a fuck. I didn't want. Uh, eh, shut up. Your face. Oh, by the way, uh, besides the. Uh, that goes as a fireball, as that would completely unripple the. Fe uh, the, the fabric of space and time. If there's anything in here you would like, take it. I think they're on the ground. You have. Uh, just give me, just give me a, just give me a type, grab it, and run because you have five. Yeah. Okay, I'll, gra I'll, gra I'll grab Mysterio. Um... <laughs> <laughs> just take you with me to have to make my stuff. My, uh... oh, okay. <laughs> uh, 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 now, he said. Um, uh, 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 I suppose Ruby will grab whatever Ruby feels he wants to. Uh, and then uh, we'll hit the exit. Grab. Nah. Uh, what plus? I think you're a plus two for now, since plus fours are like 16,000. Well, he's, he's kind of telling you rob his shop right now. Oh, shit, then. Sweet. I was. Okay. Three. I'll take I'll a four. Uh, I'll take a uh, yeah, I'll take a headband. Fucking check. Well, uh, and if there's any jewelry anyway, other than necklaces, I'll grab a bunch of rings. Uh, I was actually gonna get, grab the uh, same kind of thing as. Uh, I'll grab head for the door. Yeah, I'll grab okay. a few headbands and shit. Yeah, fuck it. Let's <laughs> just look the fuck out of his shop. Fuck it. Just um, like, just like, fucking <laughs> grab, grab whatever's not nailed down. Run. <laughs> One. <laughs> Yep. You guys get out of there. Thank you, Mysterio. The... Well, <laughs> type and... and yell, but she just like dies out of the freaking shop. Yeah, you guys get out of that shop and inside the little uh, space-time continuum. Uh. <sighs> Outside, it's rather normal. The door, the door slams shut and falls over. Eh, fair enough. Aww. Raggy's holding a dead body. Well, you know, I promised him a burial. True. I didn't say I'd bury okay, him okay, whole. Okay, I didn't say I'd bury him whole, though, did I? I didn't promise I'd bury him whole. Is that correct? You will bury him whole. Uh, uh, okay, fine. <laughs> Owen, Owen's about to slap Raggy. Look, you ate my arm. You're not eating anybody else's arms. Legs. Uh, Trap has a headband of inspired wisdom plus four. Yay. And each of you got one thing. Okay. <laughs> everything else, everything else is of uh, jewelry, jewelratica uh, experience. What? Jewelratica. It's, it's regular jewelry. Okay. Hey, it's still, it's still money. So just my arm. Okay, uh, one thing. Okay, never mind. I'll shut up. Find another uh, horn ring for your horn for your other horn. Or you could, yeah, actually, you could you could put as many rings on a horn as you want. Yeah. Uh, I'll let you know. I'll let you know what I grabbed in a couple seconds, uh, Eric. Cool, cool. 
Um, I know I just yelled out healing and fucking <laughs> healing. Mur. Anyway, um. Uh, we could take we could take a short break if you guys want. You know, sure. Did you did you say? Because I need I need the stats on that sword king again so I can put them on my sheet right. Go did you me. say he had a headband of inspiration plus four? Uh, yeah, Gan. No, 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 Ganon. Crap. Okay. Crap said he took a headband of inspired wisdom plus four. Can I have a something something of strength plus four then? Uh, it would be a belt of uh, giant strength. <laughs> can I fit the which belt? On? You're, which you currently have a belt on. I, 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 I've got a belt on, so I, can, yeah, I can't put I can't put that on. Yeah, you uh, can't double up on belts. This ain't this ain't yeah. Tetsuya no Moraville. <laughs> anyway, folks, we're gonna take a five to ten minute break so that way everyone can get their sheets updated. Well, so we'll be right back. <laughs> 